During my intern year, all interns go through a uh, leadership training program and it really helped prepare me to step into the senior resident role. Having that exposure early on throughout my intern year, we learned about how to effectively lead a team, how to communicate, and also how to be authentic in our leadership skills, really tailored to our own individual strengths and weaknesses, really helped me to know who I was as a leader and how to improve in my leadership skills. The benefit of having a career development block built into our intern year was that it took one more thing off of the table for us to think about. Intern year is a very difficult year across the board, no matter what type of residency or where you go. So it was just nice having one less thing to think about. It occurs during one of our clinic blocks and it allows us to have dedicated time to a research project. And that's very important for people who would like to go into any subspecialty honestly or just would like to grow professionally. During intern year we had our leadership training seminars which extended over the course of the whole year. We were able to talk about um, issues that may come up and how we may resolve them, how to work effectively as a team and a team leader. I've been able to take a lot of those skills and incorporate that into my own practice, especially the ones when it comes to managing a team and stepping up as a leader. Everyone that I have met during my time at Ohio State have been incredibly friendly, incredibly helpful, from the nurses who helped me from day one of my intern year to the fellows that help me now on different rotations. I've just been so appreciative of all the people that I've met and the connections that I've made and how they've helped me grow professionally. The resident attending relationship here at Ohio State has been great. They truly really feel like colleagues who have your back. In particular, they trust you to really lead the team and they almost act as the medical consultants to the team. So they really have you lead the team and then they're almost there to back you up and help you with any kind of decisions. So it's a very collegial relationship. The resident attending relationship here is always very supportive. The attending physicians always allow as much autonomy as possible to the residents. Uh, whether you're an intern learning how to do orders and, and write notes or a senior resident preparing to become an attending in your own right, they really allow us to make as many decisions as possible and they're here for support and teaching and guidance. You really feel like your patients are your own. You're not just doing the work of, of the attending or what somebody else is telling you to do, but you're taking ownership of your patients and the decisions that are made about their care on a day-to-day -day basis.